Hi, it's Damien from Anton. I'm talking to you again about Sprint Pro. Um, we get asked quite a lot what the difference is between the models. There's six models in the range now, so I'm just going to do a quick explanation as to what each one in the range is, is about. Um, with all of the instruments, um, Pro 1 through 6, you get obviously the instrument itself, bag, charger, um, the USB connector to plug it in. Um, as a standard, and then we do different kits as well, but I'm going to concentrate on the differences between the, the models. So, Pro 1 is our sort of best value, if you like, it's an entry level one. Um, it's just it's made in the same place, just as good quality, but it doesn't have some other features. That's how we can reduce the cost. So, it doesn't have the pressure transducer in it, so it doesn't have the pressure menu. You can't do left bind tightness tests, operating pressure, you know, all, the, all of the pressure range is gone, differential pressures. Um, and it, so, that does mean if you're um, working on certain appliances that ask for an operating or working pressure at the time you're doing the flue gas, obviously you wouldn't be able to do that with a Pro 1. But it does suit a lot of people. About 10% of our sales are Pro 1, so oil only engineers, um, maybe commission engineers that, that um, don't need some of the other features. You know, there's people just you know, looking for a great analyzer on a budget. Um, so there's lots of reasons why people buy a Pro 1, but be aware it can't be upgraded. If you get a Pro 1, it will always remain a Pro 1 and it can't be upgraded. The other thing that the Pro 1 doesn't do, well, a couple of things, you can't connect it up to the um, laptop. We've got some free software on our, our website where you can connect up with a USB cable into the instrument and download reports that way. Pros 2 through 6 will do that, Pro 1 you can't. And you also, the gas leak detector that we do is an optional extra on Pro 2 and comes as standard with Pro 3 through 6. Uh, won't work with it because again it hasn't got that um, sort of hardware built into it um, but it still do your differential temperatures um, you know it, it, and it's obviously got the full flu, flu gas and room te safety test menu um, but importantly if you get one you can't upgrade it if we move on to pro 2 um, now you've got the full menu so you've got your pressure uh, menu in there obviously you can use the gas leak detector with it. It is an optional extra, I think it's £65 plus the VAT, um, but you can then use that with Pro 2, it doesn't come with it as standard. Um, and um, and, it's, and Pro 2 is fully upgradable, so if later down the line you wanted to have Bluetooth, you wanted to add CO2, um, in, uh, ambient detection or, or NOx or something like that, you can do that with Pro 2. Um, Evo 2, V2, the equivalent of the Pro 2, always used to be our best selling model, but now the Pro 3 is by far and away our best selling model. So what you get with Pro 3 that you don't get with Pro 2, first of all, the detector comes as standard um, with every kit and every um, analyzer, but you also get the dual range Bluetooth in it. So now you can talk to Apple and Android devices via Bluetooth, um, but yeah, and it will, it will talk to both. And we've got Sprint Mobile free app on both platforms, and there's now lots of third party um, software if you're using one of those that wouldn't also talk to um, Pro 3. So, Anything Pro 3 and above has got that Bluetooth functionality. Um, all of the instruments, including Pro 1 and 2, will talk to the infrared Bluetooth, um, the infra infrared printer. So if you don't want Bluetooth, you want to do it the traditional way. The whole range works with the, the printer. Um, and yeah, so that's f that, so Pro 3 is about far and away our best selling analyzer now. Pro 4, 5, and 6 are a little bit more speciality units. Um, we, we are selling lots of them, but nowhere near as many as the Pro 3, which suits most people. What you get in Pro 4, over and above Pro 3, is infrared um, ambient CO2 detection. So if you're doing commercial catering or you're doing um, CO investigation work, so CMDDA1 type stuff, um, and you, look, you want to look for CO2 in atmosphere, then obviously, yeah, that's what your Pro 4 is all about. And there's some extra reports in there to help evidence that, and um, it's really quite smart. Um, Pro 5 doesn't have the CO2, but does have an NO sensor fitted to do NOx readings. Now currently there's no legislation that says you must measure NOx at annual servicing or anything like that. But there's a lot of talk in the industry around NOx and a lot of people, um, or some customers may ask for NOx. So if you need NOx, you need a Pro 5. Um, the beauty is, as I said earlier, if you've got a Pro 2 and NOx became mandatory at some point, you can upgrade it by adding that NO sensor and upgrading it to a Pro 5 at a later date. The last model, the Pro 6, has got the CO2 ambient and the NOx fitted, so it's the fully populated instrument. Again, we do get customers that buy that, that want the all signal dancing. Um, obviously, it's a bit dearer, but uh, if you need those features, then it's available. Um, hopefully, that's explained it. Um, if you go to our website, um, we've got our, our sort of catalogue here, and on 
this page, page eight and nine, it tells you about the different features and all the, what we get with the different kits. Um, but importantly, if you could also go to our website or you get one of our catalogues, have a look on the back, by postcode, you've got all the numbers of the sales managers that can help you. If you've got any further questions, we're happy to talk it through with you and give you a demo or whatever. Hopefully that's helpful. Um, let us know in the comments if you've got anything to say. Thank you.